So if you want to take out that gun and badge, I'm happy to scrap with you one day. If you want to do it, you let's do it. Let me know, buddy. That is not a crime, and you're telling me to get out of my vehicle. Broken arm! Broken arm! Broken arm! Uh, if you didn't know, I went to the police academy and they kicked me out. That's my purse! I don't know you! Spit me on my face right now! She spit in my face! Today's video takes us to Gilbert, Arizona, where I've come into contact with shocking news. Oh, Whisk Boy is no longer the lover of Ass Elmo, better known as Captain I Hate America. No, he got himself a new bona fide girlfriend by the name of Heather Ray TV. Of course, I haven't seen her without her sunglasses. I don't know what she really looks like, but Enrique's in love, and he focuses his entire video on her body. What a misogynistic pig he is. I wonder if she really knows what he's all about. Perhaps we should inform her. Go to her channel and tell her what a pig he is and how he hates women. <laughs> Joy! My with Heather Ray TV. R A E. R A E. Heather Ray. Go check her out. Subscribe. Oh, now wait a minute, ass Elmo. Don't tell me you broke up with your lover, Whist Boy. You guys have been together for a really long time, and now you're going to leave him over some loose woman? A vixen, if you will? Oh, man, loose women are good for you. You should know that by now. I wonder, does Heather Ray know about your arrest record? Oh, if she ever found out, she'd leave you. Guys, we're trying to get Heather to 3,000 subscribers by today. By today. So, subscribe. Show support. Heather Ray TV. Now look, Enrique. Are you there to do an audit? Or are you there to film Heather Ray? Because you've had your camera trained on her for quite a while. I thought you were there to expose tyrants and to promote transparency of government officials. At least that's what you claim all the time. Oh, you know what I think. I think you're kind of sweet on this girl. You haven't been this close to a woman in years, have you? No doubt about it. Well, you've been kind of sweet on your other woman. You know, Whisk Boy. What's he going to think when he hears of this news? And by the way, what does Whisk Boy not have that you find so attractive in Heather? What does she have that makes her so attractive over Whisk Boy? Look at him. He's quite handsome, don't you think? Oh, 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 you like Heather Ray now. Oh, I see. Now, it's beyond me why Heather Ray, who appears to be a nice young lady, wants to hang out with the likes of this thug. Look at him. Tattoos all over his face. I don't know. What, what does that say on there? I'm a fool? I don't know. 
But anyway, he's got his gold chain on. Yeah, man, somebody will come right up to you and snatch that before you know what happened, sweetheart. You see why he wears a baseball cap all the time, though? He's losing his hair. Might as well just shave that peach fuzz off, man. Go ahead, shave it off. There's no shame in that. Oh, no. Have a good day. Well, that was a uh, surprise to me <clears throat> that they did not enforce what the door said. <laughs> yeah, they they said restricted use of cell phones. What kind of that? Maybe just in the courtroom, I guess. All right. You notice how our good friend Ass Elmo can't keep his camera off Heather Ray? He's infatuated with this girl, isn't he? Oh, it could be a new chapter in his life. Or it could be the worst time in her life. That's what I probably should have said. Better be careful, sweetheart. And I don't mean that as a condescending thing, but you better be careful because this is one bad hombre you're dealing with. Oh, yes, he is. Oh, my gosh. Police department. Oh, look who's here. Police department. Let's go in the police department. Guys, hit the like button. For Pete's sake, hit the like button. Moments later. For real? <laughs> Oh, you better be careful there, Enrique. That clerk just smiled at you. You don't want to make your new girlfriend jealous, do you? Oh, wait a minute. I just figured it out. You're taking her along on audits, so you'll put the female staff at ease because if they think that she's with you, then you must be an okay guy. I understand now. Yeah, how much are you paying Heather Ray? Because I can't imagine her being with you out of her own free will. No, no help. Heather Ray, you're hanging out with the wrong crowd. How does this protect anything as far as American freedoms go? It doesn't. The only reason you're hanging out with Enrique is because you think he can help your channel grow. And I see you did pick up a few hundred subscribers since you've been hanging out with this moron. But if it's all about the money, you might as well go to SugarDaddy.com and get yourself somebody with some real money. Yeah, get somebody who can really spend some cash on you. Because Enrique only has a few thousand dollars, and he's not going to help your fame and fortune that much. Uh, there was a movie once. What was the name of that movie? The Players Club. And the uh, women in there said, use what you got to get what you want. So if you got it, use it and get what you want. Am I the only one, or doesn't this seem rather creepy? 
Why would you stand there and stare at this woman for a few minutes? It's been longer than a few minutes. Well, now he's focused on the computer screen, but he still wants to stand there and stare at this woman. Heather Ray, don't you see what kind of a creep he really is? Are you sure you want to hang around him? Yeah, I, I think you'd do a lot better on SugarDaddy.com or, or SugarDating.com, one of those Sugar Daddy websites. If it's money and fame and fortune you seek, it'd be a lot better to hang around with somebody who really has all that than this idiot. Remember, folks, this is all under the guise of protecting our First Amendment freedoms here in America. This has absolutely nothing to do with First Amendment freedoms and everything to do with free commerce. Yes, because by recording people in public, these idiots think they found a loophole where they can make money, and in fact they are making money. But how much longer will this nonsense continue? Not much longer, I hope. Well, there you have it, folks. I find it rather ironic that Ass Elmo focused on that Gilbert Police now hiring sign right at the end of the video. Perhaps he wants to be a police officer because he knows the Third Amendment, and that right there would qualify him to be a police officer. I can see him now running down the street after someone. Stop! You stop it right now! You're being disorderly! You're being disorderly! Disorderly! Yeah, right, whatever. Well, poor Whisk Boy got kicked to the curb on this one. Whatever will Whisk Boy do? Hmm, perhaps he can hook up with Mr. Universal TV. Well, stranger things have happened, why not? Now, if you enjoy watching idiots, imbeciles, and morons on my channel, please subscribe. Now, be sure to stay tuned because I have a new outro. As always, thanks so much for stopping by. Cheers to that. Oh, you assaulted me. I did. Oh, you assaulted me. She assaulted me. Oh, oh no. No, you're racist. Katie. Racist. Oh. oh. That's a hate crime. You're being disorderly. Oh, call the police. Call the police. Call the police. I'm not sitting down. I refuse to sit down. I refuse. Big tough guy. Big tough guy. Big tough guy. What are you going to do about it? Nothing. Nothing. You can come try to make me. You're welcome to try to make me. Take a swing. Take a swing.